what's going on everybody? Frank Slauson here with, uh, well I guess I could say, uh, finally a DVD update which hasn't, I have done probably like two months and I'm going to finally do it now. Background noise that you probably hear is the uh, fan uh, blowing and it's kind of hot here so I kind of gotta keep it on. So hopefully you'll be able to hear me and if you can't, you just adjust your volume. Anyway, uh, where, as I mentioned when I did my uh, for, little 4th of July video, uh, this is going to be a, a big DVD update, but it's not going to be that long. I just want to show you all the DVDs that I got. I'm not going to review any right now because there's still, you know, I've been kind of busy and whatnot, so I haven't had a chance to really see everything. So I just want to kind of uh, break down kind of everything that I've got. Break down. Kurt Russell. I've never seen it before. I don't even know what it's about, but it was only three dollars at uh, Walmart, as well as Hot Rod, Jimmy Neutron, Boy Genius, because everybody remembers this cartoon, Coach Carter, Versus Hostity. Which these I haven't even been opened, so I haven't even seen them yet. And these are all three dollars at Walmart. What I'm, what I'm showing you, pretty much. Without a paddle, I have seen. Very good movie, very funny. Uh, but let me know what you guys thought about this. I know they made a remake too, or a part two of it. I went directly to DVD, and it's like, geez, you know, just if it's not gonna be with the original cast, just leave it alone. You know. I have a problem sometimes like that when they when companies do that and you know they'll release you know nowadays there's more movies released now than there ever was and sometimes they'll do spin-offs and stuff and you don't really hear about it until the day that it comes out it's like oh see thanks for telling us uh, anyway uh, Footloose was three dollars now I'm sure a lot of people have seen Footloose I've heard the song by Katie Loggins many many times but uh, this uh, is the special collector's edition of Footloose so, there you go. I also got The Heartbreak Kid, and as well as I about sh the story of Shawn Michaels. <laughs> but uh, although I seen a parody that you did on WWE Magazine uh, when the movie came out in theaters, uh, having Shawn Michaels on the poster with the, the chick out here, or with all the chicks, I guess. <laughs> and let's see, there's a few more here that were three. A couple more that were three dollars, I believe. Yeah. Rograts, Tales from the Crib, The Snow White. I don't remember when this this came out in two thousand five, so yeah, I don't really remember. Uh, don't really think I've ever seen this one here yet. Yeah. Ah, Rograts. <laughs> okay. And then, We're No Angels, which I have never seen, but I know my dad has uh, this on VHS. And finally, for the $3 DVDs, Summer School, the Life's a Beach uh, collection, or edition. And I have seen this before, not this version, but I've seen, well, it's pretty much the same thing. And it wasn't a special feature in the first DVD that came out. It's a very cool 80s movie. You can check it out when you get a chance. Now. So all the other DVDs that I got were Radio Flyer, which is a very good movie, by the way, and Stephen King's It, which is kind of like a, a cross between Stand By Me, Stand By Me meets The Goonies, kind of sort of, or The Goonies meets Stand By Me, something like that. And finally, the last few that I got. The complete second season of SpongeBob SquarePants. Just going right through all these here. Of course, everyone's seen Ace Ventura. This is the special edition that I just got today, actually. I got it in the mail, thirteen dollars it costs. This is the uh, had the original Ace Ventura stuff that you know the two the DVDs that came out, but I I didn't uh, I didn't uh, I gave it to my brother after I got this because this comes with the, the cartoon set. 
That's pretty much why I got this one because I've seen the movies, and, but I like the packaging too. The packaging's really good, and the fact that they included three, three episodes of the cartoon series, which I thought was cool. And finally, the last Beverly Hills Cop movie, Beverly Hills Cop Three, probably found. And I also found the Adams Family, the original Adams Family, from season one, and season two, or volume one, volume two. Probably get volume three, maybe. <laughs> Have to have seen these. And finally, My Girl 1 and My Girl 2. And it's something I got from the pawn shop that was not open. That was it was packaged packaging and it was it was pretty good. Yeah, these movies are just classics and it's nice to add to the collection. Now there's a the, but there's a bunch of movies I have here watch it and, and I go up and ask, Well, why do you collect? Why do you you know, why do you if you don't get a chance to see what you've done or collected or whatever, or I mean, if you don't watch what you've collected, then why do you buy more? Because eventually I'll get through all of these, believe it or not. I mean, I will sell these that you see right here in the back room here. Some, there's like probably hundreds, a couple hundred that I haven't even seen yet. <laughs> and I, I want to show you something else that I did show. I didn't do a packaging opening video. Everybody that remembers the Ernest Talking Ernest doll that I got. Well, this is my Mr. Bean bobblehead doll that I got the, the day after. And there's a couple other things that I ordered from uh, eBay that will be on the way. And when they do, I'll do a couple of special. When I get everything, I'll, I'll do a package, an like, opening video for everything that I get. I'll, put, I'll just wait until I get all this stuff, and then I'll probably do a packaging opening video again. Bit my Mr. Bean bobblehead doll. Say hi, Mr. Bean. Hi. <laughs> Pretty cool, huh? I, I think this is the same one that came with the uh, movie, I believe. The uh, Mr. Bean's uh, Holiday. Uh, as far as I know. But I, don't, I didn't get that movie on DVD at the time. I don't have it yet. I uh, I just have a, a copy from the library. But anyway, that's all I wanted to show you. And uh, thanks for subscribing. Leave some feedback. And uh, that's about it. Sorry it wasn't that impressive. But... Uh, Maybe once I get a chance to review some of these movies, or you know, actually watch them or whatever, I'll review a few. But uh, who knows? So until next time, I'm Frankie Slauson. See you later.